All right, we're here at Sea Spray Marina, uh, just south of Hope Town. So, gonna got my bike off the boat. Gonna go for a little spin and check out Hope Town. All right, so this is my first time riding the bike in the Bahamas. Um, threw some WD-40 on it. Seems to be running pretty good. Put a little air in the tires. Uh, just worried about hitting potholes and uh, blowing a tire. Opening day for the Red Sox. I'm not there. Sounds like they're getting some pretty bad weather. Uh, they got a little sign here though. No parking if over two inches of snow. Boston. It's Ike's place. So that must be Ike's place there. It's pretty nice. Check it out, Ike. This is your place right there. This is the Atlantic side. It's really calm here. It's really calm on the Atlantic side today. Um, it's supposed to be a storm coming though. So, looking for a beach for Miss April. Uh, seeing which one she's gonna wanna go to on Saturday. This one's okay, but I don't think this is the one. So this looks like a nice spot and it looks like somebody else thinks it's a nice spot too because looks like they're doing some Serious construction here. Maybe putting in a dock. That's a that's a really cool house there on that island. Sweet. With the nightfall comes the shadows and the trees that Bahama bread. Yes. Is that shortening in the bread or what what uh quick, is it quick, uh, hard shortening. Yeah. It's a pretty rich dough, huh? Oh, he's a So I think that's our friend uh, Todd and Kitty's island packet there. I'm trying to uh, trying to yell to him. I'm not sure if it is or not. I don't I don't remember having them having solar panels, but those look like the flexible ones they might have just put up. So give it one more shot. Todd. So we're here in Hope Town. We're waiting for a weather window to get to Nassau. Uh, it looks like it's gonna be a little breezy for the next couple days, but then it gets worse. So we're gonna try to head out and make it to Schooner Bay tomorrow and then down to Nassau on Monday. So we'll see how that works out for us. It's a nice beach right here. Looks like there might be some squalls moving in.
right, so it's raining out. Um, I got some lemons that are starting to look a little, yeah, not so good. So I'm going to be juicing them up and maybe doing some preserved lemons. We'll see. We'll see how they look. All right, so we're making pizza dough on the boat. Uh, what I got is three and a half cups of flour and uh, two teaspoons of salt and one package of dry yeast. I got uh, one and a third cups of water and one and one one and a half ounces of olive oil. And I'm just gonna throw that in and use my dough whisk just whisking this around until it comes to a ball now I'm gonna take my container give it a spray of spray and throw the dough in it there you go now I'm gonna put the lid on it and just tuck it away in a corner here and I'm uh, gonna come back to it tomorrow so after about six hours it's doubled in size looks about like that and we are gonna throw it into the fridge, um, kind of at the warmest spot of my fridge, and just let it slow down the fermentation, but let it keep going. All right, this has been fermenting for about 30 hours. I'm gonna uh, divide it up and make it into balls and cover uh, put the balls in saran wrap. So I just balled them up and I'm gonna put them like that. All right, now I'm gonna stick this in one of the colder parts of my fridge. So the setup that I have to cook the pizza on is I have a stainless steel uh, baking steel. So You can see that it's like a nine by nine or something like that um, stainless steel about a half inch thick and I got it seasoned and I got it cranked to as high as this oven goes and this oven goes to 570 degrees so we got a very hot oven here all right we got our cheese blend mozzarella and cheddar and then we have uh, hamburger pepperoni and tomatoes all right so i'm gonna roll my dough out and then put my toppings on and then throw it in the oven there throw it in five minutes all right got it out of the oven here They were wet. Oh no. Alright, that's pizza on the boat right there.